When I was nine, I was sent to a Swiss boarding school and I didn't speak French. And it was just, you know, I didn't, I didn't know what anyone was saying. And every Friday there'd be a vocabulary test and there'd be like a French word that was kind of hard. And then there'd be like a definition of the word in French, you know, like a 20 word definition of a word. And, you know, I, I really wanted to do well in school, even though I didn't speak French. And so um, I would do this thing every Thursday night before the test, where I would tell myself to wake up at two in the morning. And I had this ability when I was nine, for some reason, to wake up at will, whatever time I told myself to wake up, you know, because we had no alarm clocks or anything. And I would just go to bed and say, wake up at two. And I would. And then I would go into the bathroom in the hallway. You know, there was a dormitory bathroom. And, you know, everyone was asleep, so it was just me. And I would sit in there and turn on the light. And I would memorize the words for the vocabulary test. But because I didn't know what they meant, I didn't know what any of them meant. Like, I didn't know what the definition words meant. I just memorized the letters of each word. Like, the letters of the word and then the letters of each word of the definition. And it would take me about six hours. But by eight, when everybody woke up, I had memorized every letter in the right order <laughs> and all the breaks of where the word breaks were. And I was able to, you know, get perfect scores on the vocabulary test, even though I didn't understand a single word. And I feel like we're all doing this in a way all the time. And I still really don't understand what any of the words I'm saying actually mean. 